Uh, Gianni Morbidelli right behind him and on road turn away goes the pace car so off they go uh, for the start of the second round of the Italian Superstars Championship and already a bit of movement there as they go uh, across the finishing line as the lights turn and it's the Jaguar of Davide Rigon who takes the lead as they head down into the first corner the first right hander here at Mugello the fastest part of the circuit but of course they're on the first uh, lap of the race so it's going to be difficult for them to reach top speed it's Rigon who leads into the corner and he's followed by Gabellini already the silver Audis of Gianni Morbidelli and Giorgio Sanna in the middle of the bagar there a little bit of a, a wobble for Baccarelli who gets punted into the uh, uh, into the gravel trap there by another car so as they come round uh, on the top part of the circuit it's still the Jaguar of Rigon what a surprise here to see uh, the 2006 championship winning car there's Baccarelli looks as if he's going to have to retire there as I said the championship winning car for Jaguar Max Pigoli was uh, the champion that year uh, back in superstars and back at the front so uh, Davide Rigon a youngster Italian talented uh, young Italian rider Formula 3000 experience Euro Series uh, some Formula 1 testing and one of the promising uh, young drivers of the future for Italian motorsport we were on board there with Giorgio Sanna and that looks like a replay in fact it is it's a replay of the incident involving Baccarelli uh, nudged off the uh, side of the circuit there into the gravel track. We're on board now with the Speed Star uh, Mercedes C63 making up the field of Max Pigoli, the 2006 champion, when he uh, uh, drove for uh, Jaguar, but he's now back.